See, I never should have gotten the car. I never should have drove to that diner. You never would have gone to see him if I hadn't put the photo in the punching bag. Yeah, you know, you just, you were concerned. You didn't want to talk about him. I chose to ignore that. I meddled. Yeah, but you're my wife. Are you not? It ain't meddling if you're the wife. It's just, it's just living. It's a fine line. Yeah, well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I said I was just going on a drive when I knew where I was going. That was a lie. I understand why you said that. I, I pushed you to open up. Oh, I opened up. Oh, I opened up. I opened up on him, and then I had my head opened up by Trené. Trené? Yes, Trené. She was a girl at the fight. Trené was very vocal. She was very rambunctious. Listen, Missy, this was all my fault, OK? And I knew better. Maybe I, I you know, I may not be made of or I may be incapable of all that you deserve. You're everything I want, and you're everything I need. And it may not be true. It is. I was meant to be your wife, and you were meant to be my husband. We, we are a, a pair, a twosome, an example of all the good in the world right here. You are, despite whatever trauma you have been through, the man you are, and I love, I love who you are. All of you, all that's tried to undo you, and all that you have accomplished. That's since. just it. See, because things happen to me. Man downstairs with a nice comforter that you bought at Restoration Hardware. Uh, pottery this... Barn. Okay, the man with the, the comforter from Pottery Barn. See, it was of no comfort. Even tonight, even after everything that's happened, when I lay my head on the pillow, a small part of me will be thinking that Trent Vaughn is under my roof. And Missy, I ain't absolutely certain that I won't be woke up at four in the morning by a punch to the face and a taste of my own blood and open my eyes to some, <laughs> you know, drunk and enraged man trying to beat up his son. Even now, you wanna know what I'm asking myself? Where in this house is the liquor? And why didn't I lock it up? So what I am saying to you, or what I'm trying to say to you, is that I may be, uh, what's, the, what's the word I'm looking for? Overcompensating for that lack of comfort. I may be trying to make this life a life that I ain't built for. It's one you deserve, but it may be one that I am incapable of providing for. He is not you, and you are not him. You see, I got a lot of unresolved shit. And you can resolve it. You are, you are starting to resolve it right now. All right, listen, what if I am simply incapable of delivering to you a happy life? Like, what if I'm so damaged and I'm so wound tight due to that damage that at the end of the day, I can't be who I want to be? can sit here and admit your fear proves that you are more than Miss your doubts. You are capable of being the man you want to be. We all have doubts and questions, okay? But living, living is about building a life that, that might deliver the answers we want. And we can search for those answers together. Yeah. 